Hello to all of my Geminis. This is Queen Amun Ra coming to you with your Freedom Friday message, Geminis. The moon is in Pisces, so if you've been feeling emotionally overwhelmed, that's why. <laughs> Leading up to this moon in Pisces. So we had the moon in Aquarius. We had that full moon in Aquarius, which the, the emphasis and the focus was primarily on your mission here on Earth. Like, how are you using your gifts and talents to help mankind help help to better mankind right and so you are the first mankind like how are you using your gifts and talents to better yourself you know through your gift and your your excuse me your experiences but also your gifts and talents and then how are you using those to help other people so there's a there's a bit of transparency there too and vulnerability when you think about how can I use my own life experiences to help better mankind so sometimes that means opening up and talking about your own experiences and how you were able to stay laser focused and how you were able to overcome obstacles and stay focused in the face of adversity. And so source is saying to you, once you get laser focused on your mission here on earth, and then you start thinking about as that moon moves into Pisces from Aquarius, and it's going to stay there for about two days, and then it's going to move into Aries, that moon in Aries is, is a fire sign. And like you as a divine masculine sign, going to give you the extra motivation, meaning fire, the extra motivation and that extra push. It can come through a conversation with somebody. It can come through a billboard. It can come through a video you watch. However it comes through, it's going to give you that extra motivation to say, I need to, I need to take some kind of action to stay laser focused on my purpose here on this earth. Remember, we're still in a cycle. And so this cycle ends on the... Uh, I believe the cycle ends on the 15th uh, or the 16th of this month, somewhere around that time. Um, the, the cycle ends. Um, we have about we have about two weeks, I think, the cycle. We, we are in this cycle for a little while. And so then we move into um, the, the new moon is on the 16th, right? So the new moon is on the 16th. So right now we're still in the cycle. And uh, we're moving towards a um, the last quarter moon phase on the 8th. And that last quarter moon phase is in Taurus. But we'll get to that soon. All right, let's go. Two of Swords. We also have the Princess of Cups. We have the Ten of Wands. We have the Ace of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles, and also the King of Pentacles. So Source is saying there's two situations for you, Gemini, that it's time for you to move on from. Two situations that has, you've allowed to get close to your heart. It can be personally or professional life. Something you've allowed where you're talking about it. Like every time you talk about it, you almost kind of come across as delusional or comes across as I'm not really clear or I feel like... you Remember when we talk about heart, the heart chakra is tricky because the heart has a mind of its own. So on one hand, I love something, but on another hand, I don't. I don't really like it. It's almost like saying... I don't like my job, but it pays my bills. <laughs> so source is saying, remember, money is energy. Everything is energy, right? So if you don't like your job, what? how are you using your time wisely, right? So source is saying, see this, if you can see this barrel right here, this is a lot of pentacles, a lot of money coming out of the barrel. So let's say, for instance, so you're just working a job and you're saying, okay, well, I don't necessarily like my job. Um, cause we're talking about money here. And so this is a resource, right? It's, it's energy, but it's a resource. Don't like my job. Don't like, you know, I, 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 I and, and this is, this money come, this King of Pentacles is coming from you working for yourself, entrepreneurship and multiple streams of income. You could be working for a company, could be working with a partner, with a friend on a business. You can have your own business. It's multiple streams of income investing. I mean, this is rich, rich right here. This is King of Pentacles. So source is saying to you, if you don't like something, first of all, recognize that you add value to wherever you are, right? This is Queen of Pentacles energy. Somebody who is down to earth, relatable. You already are ruled by Mercury, which is the communication and messenger planet. Geminis are incredibly smart because you all love to learn. Not just like, <laughs> you love, you all are literally information sponges right so that's to your advantage so you happen you have to know that every time somebody wants access to your universe you got some information to share not necessarily gossiping but you got information from a book you know that you read that you know you learn about you know 
that's personally why I like talking to Gemini's because every time, and it doesn't matter how young the Gemini is or how old the Gemini is, it's because that's how you all are wired. You, you love learning. And so there's always something people can learn from you, glean from you in your presence. And so it's something you're also learning from them. So source is saying to you, take the blindfolds off and look in that mirror, do some mirror work, right? Look at yourself. I'm a wealth of knowledge, right? I know any space that I step into, I'm, I, I have knowledge and information to share. So I want to make sure I use my time. My time counts, right? So because my time is valuable, I also want to know what I can learn. When I talk about gossip, we're talking about what can I learn? And gossip originally is really supposed to be good news, right? But what, what can I use to help me to better mankind? So I have gifts and talents. And if that, if I come in contact with a person who can teach me how to invest my money, that's what I'm looking for. I'm not looking about, you know, how many times that person was married and all, all that other stuff. So it's like, if this person can teach you something that's going to help you better mankind, it's going to help you impart wisdom and knowledge on mankind. I don't care if they came from such and such kind of family or whatever. This person got something they can teach me. My ears are open as big as satellite dishes. That's what I'm saying for your cards here. So source is sending new creativity across your path, not necessarily in the form of a younger person, but that creativity can come from anybody. It can come from this video. It can come from a conversation you have with somebody. It can come from you standing in line, buying some coffee or tea, and you talking to the person in front of you. They can give you some tips and pointers. You can overhear a conversation. So hopefully it's clicking. Hopefully it's making some sense. Your third eye is wide open. And source is about to make somebody booked and busy, not burdened at all. And that booked and busy is now that I have some new, fresh, creative ideas, whether I like my job or not, I'm getting bit, I'm, I'm creating space for booked and busy. I'm learning. I'm, I'm a sponge for knowledge, right? So that's what I'm seeing for you all. That's what I'm seeing for you all so far. So you don't have a whole lot of room for negative energy, negative self-talk, negative thoughts. That's what I'm seeing uh, so far, Gemini. So this is nice. Very, very nice. Again, the moon is in Pisces. I'm going to drop some questions below because the moon in Pisces, that's going to, hopefully it's going to help everybody. There'll be the same questions for every zodiac sign because the moon is in Pisces for everybody, right? <laughs> it's the moon, right? So source is saying to you, um, before you get overwhelmed by something, start to think, okay, first of all, if I look in the mirror and I start to see that and I'm looking and I'm speaking highly of myself like I love to learn I got to figure out what I love to learn do I, am I love to learn the, the who the latest gossip is on social media and all that or do I want to learn how to how to get to this king of pentacles because I see victory I see you getting there I see you getting to victory so you're very very close here we have the five of pentacles you just got to figure out do your shadow work Am I clouding up my universe with insecurities, instabilities, lack of career success, lack of tenacity, lack of patience? Am I clouding my own universe with that when I know, not I think or I hope, I know I'm pre it's already predestined for me to be wealthy. I already know that. So now if I'm going to talk to somebody, I'm talking to source within myself. How are we going to get there, God? <laughs> How we, right? So now somebody's speaking French. How are we going to get there, Right. So here we have the magician card. So this, this, this right here is your card, Mercury. Mercury is pre-shadow retrograde. So it's like a pre-shadow. It went pre-shadow on the third. So if you're watching the third, it's pre-shadow now. Pre-shadow retrograde is like a pre-test. Pre-shadow retro retrograde in Mercury because Mercury is the messenger planet. It's the, plus, the, the messenger and communication planet. So you're saying, God, how are we going to get to the king of pentacles? I already know I got, you know, I, I built up a reputation. I know I'm down to earth. I'm relatable. I love communicating with people. But how are we going to get to the king of pentacles, right? We, 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 <laughs> not just me, 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 right? We, how are we going to get there, right? So source is saying it's harvest time for you. So it's time for you to do the shadow work. So there's tons of videos online. It's like, how do you do shadow work? You know, type it in. It's free information. Look it up on YouTube. Shadow work. What does that mean? And how I can, how can, does that relate to me, right? You don't have to sit around and ruminate and overthink this. Get to work. <laughs> Get to work. That's what Source trying to tell somebody. Your anxiety is about to go away because somebody's saying, I'm taking off the blindfolds. 
What is stopping me from seeing something? Is it my own negative self-talk? Do I not see my own worth? Do I don't do I not believe I'm supposed to be wealthy? All of this is energy. All of it is energy. And so you're putting good energy. You're sending good energy through that mirror that's staring right back at you because you don't have any competition. You don't have any competition, Gemini. So get to work. Get to work. Get this not about who betrayed you in the past, who cheated on you, who lied on you, who who stole something from you. None of that. It's about listen. That's a part of the past. God allows certain things to happen for a reason. I need to put some steam up under myself. I need to inspire and motivate myself. Here we have the full card, the two of cups. We have the seven of coins, the four of swords, ten of coins, and also the four of coins, right? So the full card, source is saying somebody no longer feels foolish. Somebody actually feels liberated, like a changed person, and you're still feeling like you're free from something. Like, okay, I may not have understood what God was doing, but I understand now. Now it's time for double um, harvest time. So it's two energies in particular. You got to release something that you've allowed to get close to your heart, whether it was two love interests or a love interest connected to somebody else or something somebody had to release. Source is like, it's go time. It is go time. Here we have the 10 of coins, legacy wealth. Boom, right there. Legacy. What do you want your name to be known for? Certainly not gossip, not negativity, none of that. You want to be known for a person that's the dot connector. See all these, this, all this connection here. <laughs> I'm connecting the dots. I'm connecting people to people. So when people know me, they know they're getting good quality. I'm not messing up my reputation. They're getting good quality. They getting, you know, because because of all of the work you've done. Here we also have the four points. The so source is saying be conservative with your time. Time is money. Be conservative with it. Spend some time in rest, meaning. You know, meditating, spend some time with self, you know, thinking of ideas. How can we, me and source, which is really me, how can we, you know, and I'm saying, so when you say me, I'm saying yourself connected. We are one. How can we source um, get to King of Pentacles because we want to create jobs and opportunities for other people. We want to live. A, we want to live a great life here on Earth, right? This is not superficial. This is is what it is. It's like it's out here for everybody. So source is saying soulmate energy coming across your path is just like just what somebody needed. We're not talking about romantic relationship that could be great, but a soulmate could be a really good friend. It's like you know what? These are your um. These are the things that I love about you. And I think you'd be excellent at doing this. It could be a sister, a brother, a best friend. It could be a, a friend, a, your massage therapist. It could be your, your barber, whoever. A soulmate energy. See, this? these fresh cups of water, they're coming with fresh ideas, fresh creativity. You know, they're coming with joy. They're coming with healthy range of emotions. We're talking about fresh water, no codependent relationships, right? And again, source is saying, get your rest. Get your rest, get your rest, get your rest. So happy Freedom Friday. Happy Freedom Friday. Stop leaving so much money on the universe table because somebody has got on blindfolds. They don't want somebody. If you got on blindfolds about things that are that close to your heart and you're confused about it, source is saying to you, then how are you going to see the wealth? How are you going to see the answers? That God has given you unless somebody says to you, take off the blindfolds. You are blocking. You can't see the wealth coming your way because you can't see on this area of your life. You can't see the other side of your life. So source is saying, take off the blindfolds. Be grateful that God sends soulmates across our path. But a new start is coming for you. A new start is coming. It's a whole different mindset. You all are thinkers. All air signs are thinkers. You all love to think things through. Source is like, Thinking of a master plan. Let me stop before I get <laughs> before they before they demonetize this video. But no, 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 that's just what somebody's thinking. Somebody's thinking of a master plan. Somebody is saying, somebody is saying a new start is coming for me. A new way of thinking. Somebody gonna get their head in the books. That's what I said. You all are sponges. You love reading. So sources like before I, I'm not reading anybody else for filth. I'm throwing my head in a book. <laughs> I'm getting my head in a book, and I am I'm learning how to. Get to the King of Pentacles. That's what I'm seeing for somebody. So kudos and congratulations to you all in advance. You know, all that other stuff, frustrated, mad, all of that burned out. So it's like, open that third eye. Here we have 34. So there is no need to fear, dear one. Protected you are and protected you will always be. That's right. That's it and that's all. Ooh. So yeah, let's see. Let's see what else we got here. And let's close this out, Gemini. So... 
five 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 that's right get optimistic about your own future it is your future it is your universe get optimistic about it a major shift is about to come into your life experience and change your path's direction be open and stay positive and see you know i can't even say quiet is kept because you already know this you all are mutable signs mutable signs adapt easy you all adapt easier than any other sign you know, you got the fixed signs and cardinal signs. Cardinals right in the middle, but mutable signs, y'all adapt easy to situations. So adapt to being wealthy, wealthy minded, right? So that's what you want to adapt to. No more negative self talk, no more doubt, fear, uncertainty. You know, I see myself walking through my vault door. I see myself going from five of pentacles to ten of pentacles because I'm about to do the shadow work today. As soon as you watch this video, shadow work. There it is. Affirmations for focus. I am devoted to a clear mind. I take action toward my highest goals daily. I am confident in my abilities. I release distractions. I get the important things done. I am organized. I am in control of my thoughts. That's it. That is what I have for you, Geminis, and I'll see you all on Sunday. Bye.